Welcome back to another book review meter review. Today we're looking at a instruction manual from Colt titled Colt Sporter Rifles. And this is kind of an older document. So if we take this information at its face value and feel free to research more up-to-date information if available on your own. Uh, we'll just take a look at the front cover real quick as well as the back cover. And uh, there's a bunch of uh, little instructional notes there to seek more help if you have questions as well as some safety rules. So let's go ahead and take a look at this real quick. And we start off with the diagram caution warnings and uh, what this document covers and uh, more uh, suggestions for cautions and warnings of course so they continue here with their warnings as well notices and uh, let me get our list of sections. You can see quite a few there. Section 2 has some stats. More warnings in red. Cautions. More cautions. And we keep continuing. Number 27 is very important, of course. <laughs> and there's a constant theme here about safety depends on you. Never rely on somebody else to manage your own safety. That is a general rule of thumb that it should apply to everything in life. Strongly recommend that. Your own safety depends on you and you only. So, never rely on somebody else to manage your safety. That applies to everything in life. Just a life tip for those of you who seem to be reliant on others to manage your safety. Not a good idea. Um, here we go into more diagrams. Stats. There's actually quite a lot of information in here once you get past all the cautions and warnings. Uh, but then again, we have more cautions and warnings. So they want to, of course, uh, cover themselves from a legal aspect. About well ahead of time. They don't want to rely on the nanny state coming after them. But you can see plenty of cautions and warnings, and then occasionally diagrams and instructions. And once you wait past all the cautions, etc., you get to actually what's important on actual function and maintenance. So in a way, having cautions and safety warnings almost uh, kind of drowns out the actual data information for actual usage. But unfortunately, that was a sign of the times and has not improved at any point in, in the current time present either. So take that into consideration. Here we have a parts list as well as uh, some diagrams, warranty statement, a little bit of a record there, and if, in case you misplace this document you can always uh, 
when it becomes damaged, you can always get a replacement. And there, we should be able to get you a replacement document. So, again, this was just a document specifically on Colt Sporter rifles from Colt. And given the time frame, again, feel free to research more up to date information. This has been another book review, media review. Feel free to like and subscribe, and thanks for watching. See you next time.